All right, so one last midnight. We're gonna be doing a little bit of uh, No Man's Sky today. I forgot what I was doing. I was focused on um, mission target is in another system in space, right? There is. I don't remember if this is my home planet or not. I don't think it is my home planet. Bernie Sanders, what's going on, buddy? Uh, I do need plutonium, though. Yeah, I already did this stuff. This planet is totally on fire. Let's see if there's any plutonium around. There's some plutonium in the distance. We're gonna need it. I have very, very few amounts of plutonium. Are you friendly by any chance? Probably. What's the planet like? Uh... Unending sunlight, sparse, numerous, ample, low security. I don't remember what else in this planet. This system I have marked down is, uh, I think I named the system Comeback. So it's definitely a system I want to go back to. I think there was like a resource that I wanted here. Grab some of this plutonium. I really love to get a new mining tool, man, but it is so friggin' expensive. Cash is kind of hard early in early stages of the game. I don't have an enormous amount of space to carry stuff. Let's see, this is just a quick save. Is there any thanium around by any chance? I think there is. Uh, some more plutonium over this way. I have a ton of zinc. I have so much zinc, I don't need any more zinc. I believe I have enough plutonium to, to take off, but let me just get this little bit of plutonium here. And I haven't ID'd much on this planet either, but that's okay. I think I came here for some reason. Some resource I needed. I think it was for my base missions, was uh, one of the resources I needed. And I should probably go back and do some of the base missions as well. Maybe that's what I'll focus on today, is doing some of the base missions. Let's see. I think this guy had a... multi-tool, but it was like three million for the multi-tool. Yeah, he doesn't have it anymore. Did I buy that multi-tool? I don't think that I did. Because they still have this... Yeah, this little cheese bot multi-tool that I would really love to get a new one, but that's okay. Alright, let's take off. Let's get out of here. Let's see where we're at. Starbulb is nice. Starbulb is something I can make some money off of. See, what about this one? Fungi mold. Fungi mold. And this planet was what again? I don't remember what this planet was. Here, let's take off for a second. Let's go back towards the um, base station really fast. We ID these guys, right? Yep. All right, head over to space station. Question is, I don't think I have enough iron. Uh, that might be a trick, huh? Get some iron. Oh, 
Oh, great. 100,000 units to attack those ships. Uh, I don't think I really want to attack that ship right now. Get a little bit of iron. Little iron, little thanium. Come back and look at this planet over here. I thought I already had scan that one. Oh yeah, selenium planet. That was the reason why I wanted to come back there. Alright, let's go to the space station and get out of here. I think I got enough iron to... Am I taking damage? I, th I think I am getting hit by this guy. That's surprising. Let's see. Oh, don't crash. Hey, dude, if you're going to keep bothering me, I am going to attack you. All right, let's get back to my base. There we go. Let's just cruise over to this other side over here. Alright, let's see. Uh, yeah, my base. This is where I want to go. There was some sort of Corvac facility I needed to go to. I need to look at the quest that I have. But I believe one of the quests that I have is, like, uh, go to some Corvac facility and destroy it or something. Right, which is on my home base, right? So, let's look at this here. Alright, this was on... right. Attract Sentinel attention by infiltrating Corvic facility. Coordinates to a hidden Corvic facility may be secured. Destroy the locked doors. Uh, install a, a bolt caster on the multi-tool, which I have already. Uh, there is stuff here. Return the Overseer. You're waiting at the terminal. Okay, so let's go to the Overseer. He wanted something. Ah, the selenium. Right. Okay, so give him the selenium. Uh, to farm, we shall exploit the Earth free at last from the Sentinels and uh, the glory of trade. Agricultural terminal. Research station tailored to the needs of farmers. Uh, but I'd have to build another piece. Uh, once you've secured our farmer, you want to trade unhindered to profit from the glorious harvest without being dragged to and fro. Never fear, friend, or I shall make it. All it requires a few circuit boards to finish the plans for the trade terminal. Circuit boards to create an intergalactic trade blueprint. Okay. Let's 
So that's the next mission for him. What was the next mission for this guy? Did I have one for this guy? A scientist. Uh, no longer wishes to speak to me. Leave them alone. Okay, so he's got nothing for me right now. There was something for this guy, though. The weapons guy. And then I need to make a... Um, I should probably make a door over here. Let's see. What does he want? Alright, he wants... Let's see here. Where's the door? If I make another building, I'd have to put it right here. So let's see. Let's put it there. Let's get another terminal guy right here. And I want to make a door. Another door right here. All right. All right, so in here, I should be able to create a agricultural exocraft terminal. Man, that'd be nice, huh? Agricultural terminal. Let's put that one there. Requires a skilled farmer to operate. We could recruit farmers from space stations and get controlled systems. Okay. What about... Um, it's only like one terminal per, right? Yeah, one per room. It's kind of too bad. Let's see. How about we put another one? Where do we want to put another one? Well, I would like to build out this direction. How about we put the exo terminal right off of here? Uh, what do I need? Glass. Oh, I don't want a root. I don't want a glass one. Hold on. I need iron. All right, let me get some iron. There's are plenty of iron over here. I can mine. Mine up a little bit of iron. EBA, what's going on, buddy? How have you been, my friend? Uh, where do I want to put the exo terminal? I think I wanted to put that terminal somewhere. Where's my front door? There's my front door. Let's put the exo terminal over here. Yeah, I was thinking this way. Like right here. Okay, let's come back. This is the one that I want to build. Build this other guy. Let's put a door. Where's the doors? Door. Let's put a door right here.
All right, I'll just take an exit terminal. It, I think it is, and I do have a VR headset. You know, I, my son was just asking me recently, um, because I haven't really done anything VR in a long time. He was asking me, when's the next time I'm going to do a VR uh, anything? And uh, I need a technician from the space station. Um, so that's that's something that I want to do as well. So... What system am I in? Am I in a Gex system by any chance? How do I look at my map? Yeah, he was talking about maybe I should start playing some VR games. You know, when I got it, there just wasn't a lot of VR games out there. But now there's kind of there's a good variety of them. Weapons research. Uh, let's see. Destroy planetary deposits. Base construction. Acquire a circuit board. That's something that I can make. Uh, let's see here. I'm like totally filled up. Transfer all this plutonium. Let's see. Can I make a circuit board? I can. I need a heat capacitor. I need polyfiber. Polyfiber is cactus and a star bulb. Oh, I know. That means, man, that would be awesome, wouldn't it? Ash and in VR. Woo! Somebody has like a. Um, it's kind of it's like a DLL that that you can install that kind of makes a lot of different games VR ready. I mean, they kind of work well. They don't necessarily work well, but they kind of work well. You can try that. I just need to get it all configured and stuff. Polyfiber, cactus flesh. I need a bunch of cactus flesh. I need star bulbs to make, and I need a heat capacitor. What's a heat capacitor? Heat capacitor, frost crystals. Great. So I gotta find all kinds of stuff to make this stinky board. Alright, let's go to the other location I was supposed to go to, which was part of Ghost of the Machine, which was, um, I think it was like an hour. Where was that location at? Yeah, Corvic facility is roughly an hour away, but we can get up into low orbit. Speed this process up. There we go. That'll make it go faster. Whoa, 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 whoa. All right, where are you at, buddy? Oh, please don't be underwater. Dave, what's going on, man? We're talking about VR Astroneer. And how awesome that would be. That really would be pretty awesome. All right, let's go beat up on this base. Oh, plutonium. Ooh, I like me some plutonium. Eddie, what's going on, bud? Let's get uh, let's get charged up here. I'm gonna need some more iron. We're gonna piss these guys off. Why don't we get? Oh, I don't want that. Could use the plutonium though. Plutonium. Let's get a little bit more iron. Not a lot of plutonium, but we'll take it. So last night did pretty well in Ashenir. And um, with not using a research chamber. 
I, I'm pretty impressed on how well that worked out. Oh, I have the heridium, I don't have the carbon, and I have almost the iron to open that up. I should probably get that. Some carbon here. Oh, no more slots, man. I am so hurting for slots. Can't I transfer this? I could transfer it to the high suit capacity. Oh, that's the starship. Hold on. Yeah, so it worked out well. I mean, ultimately, I found a path in which uh, I can get roughly... About, um, what was it? It was like 2,000. 2,000 bytes in a very short period of time. And the respawn rate on the bytes were actually pretty impressive. Just by going off of the bytes that are on those, those trees and stuff. All right, good. I should have enough iron. What did I need? I needed uh, carbon. Okay, let's go pop this thing open over here. Where was that at? Is it down here somewhere? Right over here. Gonna have to wait for dedicated servers before we can build that again. There's just no way. So they, they did say that the new, well, they did not say it in the, in the, um, the vlog notes, but they, they wound up putting it on, um, the forum that I'm in for, uh, Ashton here. They said that the, the next release is a, is a definite save game breaker. It'll actually destroy the terrain in older save games. So there's, I mean, all all older save games you have, might as well just toss them. I mean, he can hang on to them and try them out, but, you know, they, they flat out said that it's not going to work. So we're going to have to rebuild the track. All right, here we go. Train with, oh, I don't want the train, there we go. Yeah, 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 yeah. I know you guys are pissed right now. Hold on a second. Destroy this door. Once I get in here, they should leave me alone. Awesome. Okay. Well, actually, let's get this stuff first. Get these nanites. And what is this? Is this a shield? Yeah, let's restore my shield. Perfect. Isotope, was that plutonium? Good. Use a little plutonium. I think this is like money. Can I interact with that? Nope. Alright, let's open this up. Okay, get that fixed. Oh my god, I need iron. Get that fixed. I gotta go get some iron for the boiler unit. Dang it!
Gonna wait till game release for big projects? Yeah. I, I think that's probably a good idea. Especially with the stuff that they're coming out next. But yeah, we'll see how much a dedicated server is. We'll get a dedicated server. I'm, I'm interested in doing that. I'm just real curious on, you know, how they're going to do, if you're just going to be able to stay in one system or if you're going to be able to move to multiple systems. You know, this is kind of like the No Man's Sky concept where you're able just to, to go to as many systems as you want and check out as many planets as you want. I'm also really curious on on what what uh, one point something one point plus is going to be like. I mean, what what are they going to? There's got to be some sort of story or something. Right now, it's just just build a couple spaceships or uh, space stations and you know bases and stuff. Not space stations, bases, and then that's that's kind of it. You know, I'm. There's got to be something else. Everyone's data is useless. The Korograph left this world with many, many days ago. Uh, apparently, recalling a priority transmission from their uh, species flotilla. Something has them worry. Probe the factory logs. Now probe some logs. The place seems to have been more than just a factory. It was home to the Corvette who lived within its walls. It appears that they were experimenting with anatomy from their collective. Examined video feeds. One of their internal sensors have recorded movements within the facility. It shows me footage of vents at my feet. There's something uh, in here with me. Great. Shine a light upon it. <laughs> this is probably going to wind up attacking me. You shine a light upon it and it eats me, right? Small hairy creature shaking and afraid cries out. Animal appears to have lived here for quite some time. There is a nest in the corner. Vestiges of food upon a small dish. Even a few clumsy toys and trinkets. The animal seems to have been a companion to the Corvex. The scanner tells me that the creature is gravely ill. It will die no matter what intervention occurs. Oh, wow. Uh, well, here, feed the animal. Give him a little bit of food. Takes the zinc, begins to eat. A few moments later, violent coughs up uh, much of its little meal. Only to try to continue the process, shivering with every mouthful. Move on to the factory complex, leaving the animal to its fate. Well, I probably should have feared it or something, huh? Oh my god. An elite sentinel force was deployed? That's because I didn't kill a creature. Ouch, 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 ouch. Run! Oh my god, I gotta go. Dude, that dude, that laser that guy's laser guy is tough. I'm out of here. Can I shoot him from the ground? I wonder if I can shoot him from the ground. Or from the air. Shoot him from the ground. Can I shoot him from the air? Where is he? Got that guy. Where's the advanced guy? Oh, I'm getting tagged by him, that's for sure. There you are. Joy! Joy! Oh, I taking damage. Come back around. Where you at, bud? Oh, I totally missed. Uh, not very good with this ship attacking the ground. No! Get out of here! There we go. There you are. Boy, buddy. Alright, I think that's what I was supposed to do. I got a little music. 
Maybe that's a good thing. Destroy drones before they alert others. Did I just finish this? I might have finished this. This guy's dead, right? Why's he got a weird old light? Yeah, he's dead. How popular the became comes after release? Yeah. I think I I don't know I. Hopefully they don't rely too heavily on on modders to to do some of their features. It'll be interesting to see how that that comes out. But being able to do crossplay on dedicated servers, that, that's going to be fun. Nothing I can do here, right? I, I finished this off. And these doors, I can't get into these doors, right? Yeah, I need an Atlas Pass 2, and I don't have an Atlas Pass 2. I only have an Atlas Pass 1. Yeah, that's an Atlas Pass 2. Alright, let's get out of here. I was supposed to return to somebody. Uh, return to space and contact Apollo. Okay, that's one thing that I could do. Or I can hire a farmer. Droid planetary deposits. Where is this? Where is this located? Is this here? Where is that at? How far is that? Deposits like 13 minutes. We can get to that pretty fast. Whoa, 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 whoa. Where's the deposit at? There we go. We'll get there roughly in a minute. Let's actually come up. Get there a little bit faster. Get the speed way up. There we go. Let's come back down again. Yeah. Dude, I'll talk to you in a minute, Apollo. Hey, get back down there. Talk to you two in a minute. Oh, shoot. I lost my position. There it is. All right, we do this, we're gonna have sentinels all over us. Let's see, pulse engines are pretty much full. Let's fill that up a little bit. Uh, hyperdrive, yeah, I'm gonna have to make. That's good, life support. Finish up some of that thanium. Iridium, I think I could transfer over the iridium, right? Yep, I don't have much space left. I've got to sell some stuff off. All right, what is in this stuff? Do we know? I don't know. A ton of plutonium, plutonium over here, though. Let's recharge, reload the bolt caster before we get into this. That's not doing anything. How do I destroy this thing? Um, okay. Aha! Oh god. Oh, laser dude. Where's he at? Oh. Holy god! Oh. 
Die, doggy. All right, doggy down, doggy down. Okay, you're down too. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. I got somebody on me. Stay still. Thank you. Where's the... We have another guy floating around here somewhere? Where's he at? Nope, Sentinel Force deactivated. Okay, wasn't that what I was supposed to do? Supposed to destroy another one? Die! Uh-oh. Can't die yet. Oh, that really pissed him off. Alright, return to the armor. Awesome. That's what I was supposed to do. Get in the ship. Neon, what's going on, buddy? Thanks for joining the stream, man. I'm out of here. I think my base is just across this water over here. I really have to figure out how to start making some money. The armor wants to talk to me. I gotta make doors on the other side. There you go. What you want, buddy? What you want, buddy? Uh, yeah, I summon them. Sis, you can fight them too weak. Take this uh, photon blaster blueprint. Build it for their arrival. What? High energy blast modification. Problem is I don't have enough space on my stinky weapon thing. For the fight, ask another task. You need to be strong to serve you. There's substance. An offering freely given to the young and the elders. That may yet restore me. I've spent my years of meshing. Waiting for the release date for Xbox One? Sweet. Isn't that coming out with the, the new update in August? Revenant's found on Viking Dagger. Should be enough to heal me for now. Armor requires to get to prevent them for further decline. <laughs> That's right, man. The cool kids do land sideways. You're so right. Feel the end approaching, not strong enough, but I have faith, but I, nightmares in a roper, da 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 da, crimson eyes before me, wombs up to the world, yeah, yeah, yeah. Grow silent, appears troubled. Yeah, you're not gonna die yet. Not till I shoot you in the head, buddy. Okay, so he has nothing for me right now. He's still scared of his own mortality, I think. Can I, I, I thought I was in a Gex system. Let me go back to the terminal. This is the current system. Am I not in a Gex system? Yeah, No Man's Sky, the, the new release is going to be kind of interesting to see how they do true multiplayer. Right, that's finally meeting one of their last obligations that they said they were going to do uh, at launch. That they never quite did. Free to play for gold members? Nice. 
That's actually a pretty nice deal. Who is this guy? Sales. You have oxide. Oh uh, god, I don't have a rare. I don't have titanium. No. He's like, piss off! You didn't give me what I needed. Here, how about a gift? All right, my standing with them increased great, but that's not really what I needed. Uh, I'm gonna need a Gex system. Let's see, where is there a Gex system? The spaceship is here. Let's take off. See if there's a Gex system close by. All right, that's where I am. Uh, dun, 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 dun. Corvac, Corvac. Man. It will be. It will be in August. That is their propaganda. Ooh, there's a Gex system right there. But that's out of jump range. These are out of jump range as well. Warp reactor tau required here. Yeah. Wish upon a star, no doubt. I can't jump too many spaces, though. This is 34 light years away, and it says I can jump there. But I couldn't jump to the one that is... Can I jump here? I mean, really, can I jump here? Unable to warp. Dang it. Come on. Well, it doesn't look like I want to find a Gex system. Within range. Uh, well, here's one. All right, let's go here. I just need to go to the space station so I can hire, what is it, the farmer? Scan this. An abandoned building. There's some fungal mold. Radio station I can listen to. Somebody's contacting me. The Atlas guy's contacting me. I need to talk to him. Gamma root. Uh, I wonder if I can pick that up. Trading post there. And this is an abandoned post, right? Abandoned building. All right, let's go head over to the space station really fast.
get in here. Oh, that's the engine. Yeah, that would not be a good place to go. Hey, bud, where's the... Oh, there you are. Hold on, Atlas. I'll talk to you in a minute, man. Just get in here. I want to see if I can hire the farmer so I could possibly start making money. I'm I'm hurting. I can't. There's nothing I can can't upgrade my multi tool because it's like three million. And there's there's a farmer. Yeah, dude. Good. You chirp. You're happy. Come to work. Sweet. We got an agricultural guy. Who is the guy that... A technician. That's what I wanted. Oh, man. I got two guys in the same spot. Nice. Higher. All right. Those are the two guys I wanted. That helps a lot. It's always good to have that. Let's see what the blueprint trader has for me to offer. What do you have for me? You offer in my friend. Anything that I can buy? Economy scanner. Galactic scale sensors. Device allows the user to access detailed economic data about the system traveling. Ooh, interesting. Accelerated fire. Yeah, I can't really do that. Phase beam. That'd be nice. All these I can't do because my multi guy is down. Cowboy Bebop. I don't know Cowboy Bebop. Like, I'd love any one of these ships, too. I just can't afford any ship. I am so weak right now. I am so weak. Uh, Alright, let's, let's look at what I have here. I'm totally full. In my exosuit and in the starship, I should probably go back and start building some sort of storage container. So let me go do that. Let's go back to my system. Build some storage containers. Outlaw Star? Don't know Outlaw Star either. Cowboy Bebop or Outlaw Star. Negatory. Yeah, let me go build some storage facilities. Stop dropping, start dropping off some of this stuff for storage. Head back over this way. I forgot the name of that system. Shirt! Shirt! Japanese anime? I mean, I was into that when I was a lot younger. I used to watch, uh... Oh, man. Star Blazers. You ever watch Star Blazers? Star Blazers was awesome. I think I even still have Star Blazers. Okay. How much is a storage facility going to cost me to build? Our Star Blazers. Oh, uh, now you're making me want to watch that. Okay, container. Oh man, I need two voltaic cells. What's um voltaic cell? It's gonna be what to make? Something I don't have space for. And it clusters. I can transfer these, right? Yes. All right, I got enough for two. Can I do voltaic cells? I thought I... Yes, I can. Aha! Let's build another one, shall we? 
Excellent. Can I stack these guys? No, of course not. Of course you can't stack those. Why would you be able to do something simple as stack those? You suck it. Alright, I'll put that down right there. I put my next one right next to it. Alright. Storage unit zero. Really? You only have five things I can put in there? Transfer that. Let's transfer the Mordite. Star bulb. Let's transfer the star bulb. Transfer this. Transfer the solarium. Okay. That helped. Uh, how about we create a couple more... I need 50 for the... Get the bulb. You only get 10 bulb per. And that, that not going to do it. Really? Yeah, they made this game really grindy. Grindy is all hell. You know, I go back to some of the first MMOs that were out there. I was big on Asheron's Call. And when when you played Asheron's Call, the crafting in that was so in-depth. Like, so let's say you played an archer. You had to go build your arrows. You had to go build your arrow tips. You had to do all that stuff before you can go out and uh, do anything. And if you were a mage, oh my god, you had to do so much prep work. Like, at least a half an hour of prep work before you could actually start playing. And while it was tedious as all hell, it was actually pretty good, but now I'm finding games like this to just be way too much time to invest into it. Okay, we got two. Let's put down another vault. I wish these vaults were a lot smaller, at least for what I get. The vault should be tiny. All right, let's put down vault number one. Can we put it on top? See, it won't even let me put it on top. Oh, it will. All right, put it on top. I can access it, right? Good. All right, I need the Atlas Path. This thing, I don't, I don't even know what that is. Orbit casting. I think I can stack these now, right? All right. Do I have anything else? Let's transfer that over. Storage container inventory. Wow, I can stick that in a storage container from here now. Nice. I did not know that. No modules. Okay, titanium, iridium. I don't think I need iridium right now. Let's move that over. Zinc. I'm carrying a ton of zinc. Iridium's fine. Platinum's fine. Emery. I don't think I need emery right now. Oh, I have no more space in my storage container units. Oh, man. That sucks so bad. These big, giant containers can only hold five items. You sucketh. All right. Well, at least I got some inventory. Yeah. Goo goo gaga to you, bud. All right. Let's talk to these other guys. Let's see. Where's my log say? I got to go to space to talk to that. Uh, return to the technician. Yes, return to the farmer. Fire circuit board. It's a lot of work. Build that ejector. Who was that for, by the way? I don't remember who that was for. Weapons guy. Collect a dagger. You gotta go to the global market and try to collect a dagger. I, don't I have access to the global market over here? No. Alright, let's go talk to... That's the tech. Let's talk to him.
greet this guy. Build a geo bay from the schematic. And the extra craft will be mine. Okay, that'll help. Uh, two cells and a dynamic resonator. Oh man, I don't, I don't know that I have a dynamic resonator, but okay. Where's the farmer at? Over here. Hey, farm dude. Okay. Bright seeds and planter plans received. Bow smelling farmable flower that replicates the chemical structure of fecal matter. Great. When planted inside, yields a harvest of coprite. A good alternative to collecting coprite by hand, which requires feeding animals and then harvesting their droppings. <laughs> oh, nice. Oh, wow. Except you need uh, 60 coprite to be able to build this thing. Great. 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 That's exactly what I wanted. Grow the flowers and see how fine it feels to produce life. Okay, so he's giving me stuff that I could do. Okay, wait. So he's got trays I can build. Let me see this. Farming. I need iron. Dark <laughs> collecting space cow poop? Yes. Exactly. Alright, let me get some more iron. able to build this tried to remind me of a pig farmer all right let's see Ooh, where to get the platinum from all right that was oops I got through the wrong door sorry this is the door that I wanted to go through. No, nope, that's not the door. This is the door I wanted to go through. Alright, let's build another one of these stations here. Hydroponic tray, self-containing indoor systems. That's what I was supposed to build, right? Large hydroponic tray. Ooh. Why can't I build this? Too big? It's too big. I need a, uh, I guess I need a bigger area. All right, what? Not enough resources. Oh, yes, right. Thanium, carbon, and uh, coprite. I need to go collect some poo poo. Uh, nice. All right, let's build another one of the small ones. Let's get, yeah, let's get, yeah, why not? Hey, why not? Why not? We got this place loaded up. Yeah, I gotta go feed animals. Hey, give me a break here, buddy. I don't think my system has anim that many animals to begin with. Plant in a hide. Yeah, I got gotcha. you. I understand. All right, what else can we do while we're at it? Let's go talk to the Atlas guy. We've got to collect a dagger, but that means I just have to go to a space station, right? Maybe, hopefully, buy one. Let's see. Let's go talk to um, 
leap in the dark. I just have to go to space for this. Plutonium around. A little over there. Some zinc, which I don't need. Oh, and the guy wanted me to build the... What was it? The Geo Bay thing? Exocraft. Dynamic resonator. What? What's going to take for me to build a dynamic resonator? Probably like an arm and a leg. Can I even build a dynamic resonator? No. I cannot build a dynamic resonator. That means I need to buy one. Oh, really? Oh, you suck on many levels here, bud. I don't have money to go buying dynamic resonators. Uh. All right, let's go talk to the Alice guy. <laughs> What's going on, fat? <laughs> Let's see here. All right, ship's communicator. Talk to this guy. Good work. Oh, attack on the factory paid off. Oh, I don't know why he's British, but he is. <laughs> uh, did you get any useful data? Uh, ask what happens next. Did I get any useful data? Um. I don't know that I did get any useful data. Say no. No matter. We have what we need. Good. If you have what you need, then why did you have me go over there anyways? Countless signal f uh, flares when the Sentinel started to appear. Energy streams sparked beneath the planet's surface, moving from monolith to monolith. Okay. Must be on the right track. Examine these structures. They're linked. I know it. Good luck. I'll speak to you on the other side. Great. You were really helpful. So what's the new objective? Coordinates received. Link detected. Where am I supposed to go? Over there? Got the scan items? Oh, no, man. No storm. I gotta get out in a minute. Just over this hill? Let's see. This is it. Thank you huh? for joining me on this adventure. If you guys like the it. series, please put a like. If uh, you have any comments, leave the comments in the comment section below. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel. I really appreciate your support. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye.